Hello, I'm Ryan Rafels, and I'm here today in a very special video to show you some nerd stuff that I built. So let's get started. Now, if any of you are familiar with Star Trek, which you're probably not, you may recognize this right here. So this is step one to fulfilling my childhood escapism fantasies and turning my house into a starship like I've always wanted. So, um, yeah, I guess I'll just give you the rundown here. What this is is a uh, case of an ABB chart recorder used in industrial settings. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> what I did was I just took the empty case and um, I added some decals up here, made it for engineering, whatnot, and I went over these keypads and I painstakingly cut out every single one of these little buttons to go over the overlays here, and I drew this up, well I didn't really draw it, I guess I kind of composited it in uh, Photoshop and printed this out, it's something like 11 by 10 to fit in the window here, and then back behind the door I lit it all up so that it illuminates and everything like a... Uh, computer panel you'd see in the show so let's light it up we shall i mounted the little switch right on the bottom here <laughs> and this is for the screen portion so it lights it up just like that and then the bottom portion as well is on a little remote down here and lights up different colors and such so yeah <laughs> that's really all there is to that um all these colored lights down here are on three separate little strips that are mounted behind this right here, which is normally where there'd be some wiring to display boards and such, but that's not important. So, yeah. This one is uh, basically you got to use your imagination to make it function, but I am working on that. So, moving on from step one over there, I'm in the process of step two which is going to be this, I don't know what you want to call it, basically going to be a bottom portion to that, so like you kind of have your, okay, if you ever seen the show, you kind of have the stations that they stand at, like, you know, the next generation along the back of the bridge there. This is basically what this is. So this is the bottom portion, and then what I built before would be the screen up top. So I pretty much just have it laid out. This is an old cabinet. Oh, it actually was a bookshelf. This is the bottom portion of it, and I started taking it apart and everything. And um, I'm going to put in some of those, uh, you know, those fancy... I'm really good at explaining things. <laughs> those fancy little pieces of hardware so, like, you can push on the cabinet door and it'll pop out at you and you can just pull it open kind of thing. It's magnetic. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. But that's really not important, so I'm going to put those on there. This whole thing's going to be painted a dark gray, and again, I'm going to dick it out with decals and all sorts of everything like that. And all this stuff on top that's just sitting here is going to be mounted into the top. I'm going to print out something to go in here, kind of like I did on the last one. And all of these are going to be backlit and illuminated. And yeah, it's got much more levers and switches and everything, make it more interactive and all that jazz. And I've got on my very messy desk over here... <laughs> I bought myself an Arduino chip that I'm learning how to use so that I can do something to make it even more interactive. I'm not entirely sure what that is yet, but it's going to be something, and it's going to be great, and my house is going to be a starship. So, um, yeah. That's all i got to say about that. I'll keep you posted. 